class of the texture prep material. And I think uh, like I showed you guys how to uh, get the, the tail end and also the wings, almost said feather. And also now the last one is the mid torso here, right beyond the neck, just head, neck and torso, and then the rear uh, of the grasshopper. So I just did a real quick uh, grab of that. And this has got part of our leg indentation. Again, I'm gonna go up a little bit bigger with that. And we're just uh, taking that uh, base layer out. So we have an alpha channel. And again, using our same techniques that we've used before, we go up a little bit uh, on the brush on this one and hit uh, Alt or Option and uh, take out these harsh uh, highlights so it doesn't read as a ridge. And again, uh, I know you've heard me say this a hundred times, but try not to create uh, mud, try to create a nice line here or delete the line without adding so much of these hard ridge lines. You will create these ridge lines. Uh, we'll get into sculpting a little bit more in uh, substance. So we have these little micro uh, bumps. Um, again, we have, all of us have some sort of bumps on our face and whatnot. Pushing that forward, get rid of any of that stuff here. I think you guys probably get the, the gist of it. You could probably fast forward this because you guys have done this a, a thousand times. But again, I don't know what, I just have a hard time reading my form here. All right, so, oh, my scratch disc is full, oh my gosh. All right, so I think I'm gonna stop here because I don't wanna fill out any more of my uh, computer before it crashes. So I wanna stop here. Anyways, uh, get rid of all your ridge lines and save it as a PS PSD. All right, good luck with this, guys, and I'm sorry uh, my scratch disk is full.